Within the field of physiotherapy, there are different specialties. So one of which is neurological physiotherapy, and there is musculoskeletal physiotherapy and respiratory physiotherapy. So neurological physiotherapy is very much concerned with helping those individuals who've got conditions that affect their brain or their spinal cord or the nerves in the periphery of their, of their body. The majority of our work at Physiofunction is in the area of neurological physiotherapy and we use what I've termed the rehabilitation triad to help individuals maximise their independence and that's a combination of hands-on physiotherapy, technology and exercise. And primarily we're reteaching that individual how to use their, their body following a, a catastrophic injury or a serious illness. As a neurological physiotherapist we're, we're a little bit like a, a coach so we guide the movements and we look at what's preventing that. Is it weakness? Is it tightness of muscles? So we'll help with loosening off tight muscles and strengthening weak muscles and then guiding them through so they can perform that action that they're currently struggling with. Part of the assessment process is looking at that individual and trying to determine what combination of hands-on therapy, be it stretching or strengthening or massage, or what technology from our range of technology will help that individual. And of course that all has to be within the context of exercise. And that can be exercises that we supervise while people are with us, or they can be exercises that we instruct people to do at home. In addition to exercise, we also encourage physical activity. My specialty and my joy and I feel and my clients I'm hoping would back that I excel in hands-on treatment. I trained through the bow bath approach of neurological physiotherapy up to advanced level. I use my hands to facilitate their movement and their recovery. My hands on their limbs, joints, muscles tells me so much about them and their abilities. It can tell me if a limb is high toned which would mean resistant um, stiff, rigid, spasticity, or if the limb is low-toned, which can mean it's very floppy, can be painful, flaccid. And I can pick that up and then tailor my handling to that person's needs. That's not standalone. I obviously would include any technology, any equipment, anything else that was necessary. But that's my starting point. I think it's comforting. Some of our clients are very nervous, very frightened um, when you move them out of their wheelchair to sit on an edge of a bed. If you're close and you're handling their trunk or their head position, that gives them more confidence. Hands-on, I feel, to me, optimises a patient's potential. It's very often in the, in the journey that individuals are, are told that they're as good as they're going to get. And I often feel as a clinician that that's as good as current resources can enable that individual to get. I believe for many individuals there is a great potential for further recovery. Often our, our clients report that they've been told they've reached a plateau in their recovery. To me a plateau is a level area before you go on to the next part of the climb. A plateau is not a summit. So our role at Physiofunction is to take you from the plateau to the summit.